Earth is always changing and moving, just like how you grow and learn new things every day. But instead of growing taller, the Earth changes its surface in different ways. These changes happen at different time and spatial scales, just like how you might learn a new skill quickly, but it takes longer to master it. For example, let's talk about how the Earth's surface changes at large scales. Imagine you're building a tower out of blocks. If you build the tower very slowly, block by block, it might take a long time to build a tall tower. This is similar to how the Earth's surface changes over millions of years, like the slow movements of tectonic plates that can uplift large mountain ranges. On the other hand, imagine you're building a tower and all of a sudden, all the blocks fall down. This is like how the Earth's surface can change quickly at small scales, like a rapid landslide or a volcanic eruption. These events can change the local landscape dramatically, but it's only a small change in the grand scheme of things. Another way the Earth's surface can change is through weathering and erosion. Imagine you've built a sandcastle at the beach and the waves keep crashing against it. Over time, the waves will erode the sandcastle and it will become smaller and smaller. This is similar to how the movements of water, ice, and wind can wear down the Earth's surface and shape local geographic features. A great example of geoscience processes shaping a geographical feature in the United States is the Grand Canyon. One of the main processes that has shaped the canyon is erosion. The Colorado River and its tributaries have been carving through the rocks of the canyon for millions of years. The river and its tributaries erode the rock by carrying sediment and wearing away at the rock surface. So, in short, the Earth's surface is always changing at different time and spatial scales. Sometimes these changes happen slowly over millions of years, like building a tower block by block. Other times they happen quickly, like all the blocks falling down. Just like how you learn and grow at different speeds, the Earth's surface changes at different speeds too.